Hello, here's a tutorial for a new open source software called Secutor. Secutor is a task and workflow runner used for security assessments. It supports dozens of well-known security tools and is designed to improve productivity for pen testers and security researchers by providing unified input and structure output. Secutor is created by Freelabs, EA cybersecurity company. You can find our details on the description. To find the help for Secutor, simply type Secutor help. You will see the commands task, workflow and scan to list all tasks you use Secutor X help and you will see all the tools that Secutor uses for security testing. To access help for a task, use Secutor X task name, MIM help and you will see all the available run options. Run options are mutualized amongst tasks so that you don't have to remember individual run options anymore. Let's run vulnerability scan using Nuclear via Secutor. We format the output with the table flag to improve clarity and readability. Workflow is a set of predefined tasks that can run in parallel or one after the other. To list all workflows, use Secutor WOE help. To access help for a task, use Secutor WS subdomain cron help, and you will see all the available run options. Let's run a host reconnaissance workflow. Um, this workflow allows launching a suite of four tasks, Naboo to find open ports, and map to find associated vulnerabilities and nuclei to find network SSL and HTTP vulnerabilities. Ports are shown with the lock icon. Vulnerabilities are shown with the red bell icon and outlined in green. Exploits corresponding to vulnerable software versions. In this case, Apache HTTPD 2.425 are outlined in red. Workflow definitions are YAML files, which can be found in Secutor's configs folder. You can also create your own workflows and plug them in. A scan is a set of workflows that run one after the other. To list all scans, use Secutor Z. Help. To access help for a scan, use Secutor Z scan name help, and you will see all the available run options. Let's run a host scan. You can view the results in real time using the table output option and the scan results are saved in JSON and CSV formats at the end of the run.
here's an example of the scan results in CSV format. Here's an example of the scan results in JSON format. Well, if you want to know more about Secutor, check our online documentation. The next video will talk about advanced features such as saving results in database using global options, using proxies, writing custom workflows and scans. If you like our content, please like and subscribe. Just stay updated, follow Free Labs on social media. Happy hacking.